So my name is Vishesh Jain. I'm from Jaipur, Rajasthan, and currently I'm a final year B.Tech student studying uh, pursuing uh, information technology from IIIT Allahabad. And this July I'll be joining uh, Deutsche Bank, which is an MNC as a software developer. I was preparing for GMAT, and I recently gave my GMAT exam uh, with the help of Chambori Education. So uh, I'm looking for uh, MBA in finance right now, and uh, or maybe consulting. And uh, the universities that I have in mind are first one is on my list is in US that is National University of Singapore and the others that I have in mind are in Seed and HEC Paris and uh, uh, London School of Business so these are top universities that I'm currently thinking of. Okay, so I started preparing for the program. Uh, in January 2024, that is this year, and no, I did not uh, do it on my own. I decided to go with some coaching center and Zamboria, like uh, it was on Google and YouTube everywhere, it was like the leading institute for this preparation. So I decided to go on with Zamboria. I haven't studied much in, in the online, like uh, in college, I did a couple of semesters online, but uh, my entire life I've studied offline only. So I went with that only. So I, uh, I went with the offline part. So like there is not only one single thing, but uh, I would like to begin with the faculties. So the faculties were brilliant. I mean, they're all very experienced and uh, the teaching methods were very good. So like even if you're not familiar with any of the topics of quants or like verbal, so they did a really good job in that. And apart from that, uh, the coaching material and the portal, it was also really helpful. And they have also introduced this one, Smart AI Bank. So that was also really helpful. Like it helps you to prepare for the actual original GMAT, which is an aptitude test. That was one of the best things, I would say. So my, uh, I've always been strong with the coins part. And, but my weakness was the verbal section. Okay, so how Chambori helped me is that, uh, the like uh, faculty I already mentioned. So the faculty, uh, Alok sir, he really helped me a lot with that part. And also the mock tests that are available in the portal and the modules also. So they did a really good job in helping me understand the concepts and how to solve the questions in the given time frame. Okay, so uh, I gave roughly around 15 to 20 sectional tests and full length test I gave around six on the portal. And apart from that, I gave five to six official GMAT tests that are on the, on the portal of mba.com. First score, I would say it was around 6.15, I guess, if I remember correctly. Yeah, so like, I was giving a competitive exam after a period of four years, so I was quite nervous because like I had that pressure to perform well. So I was a bit nervous uh, the previous night of the exam, but like I arrived 20-25 minutes before uh, my schedule time at the center, and the guy over there, he was like re really good with that. So he helped me to calm down. So yeah, that was the experience. I was a bit nervous uh, during the middle of the paper as well. But then as I was able to solve the questions and I was, I knew that in quant section, I was getting the correct answer. Was I, I have that feeling with the quant section. So yeah, so it went well at the end. Okay, so like, uh, I just focused on the questions. I read the questions carefully. And because I knew that uh, if I have to like get a good score, then I have to answer that question correctly. Was if I keep on answering the uh, questions incorrectly, then definitely my score would lag. The questions carefully and that helped me score really good on the exam day. So in cons, it was 90 out of 90. And uh, in verbal, it was... Uh, I don't remember the score, but I remember the percentile. It was 91 and in uh, data insights, it was 79. So overall it was 98 percentile and the score was 695. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Like I wanted to go past like seven. It would look really nice, but yeah, right now I'm happy with the score. Okay, so the advice that I would like to give is that, uh, First is with the forcing that uh, whenever you're giving any mock test or any, uh, so yeah.
So whenever you practicing or giving any mock tests, just make sure that you read the questions carefully because in GMAT the questions are always a bit tricky. So just try to read the question carefully and then you'll eventually get the right answer. And apart from that, uh, just keep focusing on your weak section. Like mine was verbal all the time. So I practiced, like I gave all the mock tests, all the sectional tests that were available on the Jambori portal and also discussed it with my teacher. He also gave me some uh, PDF solutions and along with questions. So like, so that really helped me overcome that verbal section particularly because that was the weakest section. So it's just that you need to practice hard on those sections and eventually you'll get a good score. So at first, like I was a bit hesitant to go with the coaching because it's been a couple of years since I've done that. So, but when I went there, it was really nice. There were very few students in my class, but again, that was a plus point, I would say, because you'd get the whole attention to you. So, and the teachers kept mentioning more than a couple of times that they were fantastic throughout the coaching part. And uh, apart from that, any point was just say that it was a brilliant experience overall and it really helped me uh, that this exam also I would say that it really helped me to like uh, overcome some of my difficulties like vocal section has always been my uh, like thing I've suffered with throughout my like school time also I would say that so that really helped me to overcome that the coaching and the practice the mock tests and everything